Hello everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to recover files from a USB flash drive using Wondershare Photo Recovery. The first step of course is to launch Wondershare Photo Recovery and make sure that your USB drive is connected. After that we're just going to click on the start button and this is going to load up all of the drives that are currently connected to our computer. So if I go down here and select my Lexar USB drive, I can go ahead and make sure that's the one that we're going to be searching for. If your drive doesn't show up, you can just click on Refresh Drives and it should pop up as long as it's properly plugged in. We can also go into the Filter Options and inside of here we can dictate which regions of the USB drive we're going to search for as well as what file types we're going to be searching for. In this case, because I'm not too familiar with what might be on here, I'm just going to search for everything. If we go over to Select Region, you can go ahead and set starting and ending sectors on your drive. This is a bit more of an advanced feature but it can be very useful when really trying to pinpoint some locations. Once we're happy with all of these options, we'll simply click on the scan button, and it's now going to start scanning for recovered files on our USB flash drive. And of course, the amount of time this is gonna take will depend on how many file types you have selected, as well as how large your drive is. And once that scan is complete, it's going to load up all of the file types that it's found, as well as the ones you've selected. In this case, we have audio, photo, and video, and then subfolders with each of the formats. The cool thing about Wondershare Photo Recovery is we can actually click on these photos and videos, and most of the time we can actually preview them, which is really cool and really will help us find the files that we're looking for. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and make sure all of the file types I want are selected, and the ones I don't want deselected. And down in the bottom right corner, it's gonna tell you all of your selected files, how many you have selected and how large they are. In this case, 553 files, just under 400 megabytes. So once we have all of our files we want to recover selected, we're just going to click on the recover button and we're going to select a drive that is not our original, otherwise it will overwrite them. And then we'll simply click on the recover button. And now it's going to go through and recover all of those files for us. Of course, this is going to take different amounts of time for different numbers of files and different file sizes, but it's usually a pretty quick process as it's just copying these files. And once it's complete, it's going to go ahead and load up the folder that it's all been saved to. You can see it's again separated into different folders. So we can go in and we can view all of our newly recovered media. And from there, you can go ahead and back it up on another drive, take a look at it, or do whatever you want. And that is it for this video, I hope you guys enjoyed. That is how you recover files from a USB flash drive using Wondershare Photo Recovery.